Did you know that there are hidden cooking quests in Black Desert Online? From quests that pop up while cooking to repeatable weeklies that can give you a ton of contribution in cooking materials. <laughs> Welcome back to another Black Desert Online Guide. My name is Teddy for anyone that's new. Today I'm going to be showing you guys a little couple hidden cooking gems to net you a ton of contribution. As always, if you guys enjoy the content, be sure to smash that subscribe button and make sure to turn on those notifications so you know when I post another Black Desert Online Guide. With all that out of the way, put on your canape clothes, get those dishes ready, and let's start unlocking these hidden cooking quests. To start this, we're going to be heading over to Velia here. And and talking to the blacksmith Trenon Underfell. Accepting his quest, Newborn Kittens, will unlock the Caltheon Slums quest. This quest requires you to catch the newly listed fish Corvina, which can be done using AFK fishing, which sucks. Equipping the plus 10 Balanos fishing rod, a plus 10 maple tree float, Creos fishing chair, and a tri Manos fisher's clothes. Finally, will help speed up finding this fish needed. If you don't, it's okay. Not having any of the items listed will only slow down how fast you find the fish, so be patient and soon enough you will have your prized fish. Once you finally have the Corvina, head back to Trannon and turn in the quest to unlock the bonus cooking for Calfion Slums quest, which has a small chance of being obtained when cooking. Once obtained, it requires you to make the number of dishes required and to be delivered. When you have them done, hand them in by heading over to Calfion here and talking to Govin. This will net you 300 contribution and your choice between 1000 milk and 1000 eggs. Now let's talk about the other bonus quests that will pop up while you cook. There are three random quests that now have a chance of being obtained while cooking. Much like cooking for Calfion slums, you will receive cooking for Hydaelyn soldiers. These bonus quests require you to cook the required amount of dishes and turn them in for 300 contribution points and your choice between 500 high quality onions or 500 high quality pepper. Lastly, let's talk about these weekly cooking quests. To start these quests, three non-repeatable quests must be completed in order to unlock them. So how do you start these quests? Heading past the Black Desert to Arahaza Town and talking to Roruju will start the quest chain. He requires you to speak to the wharf manager Lucy to start the quest, Story of Becoming a Cook. Comment down below if you were confused on how to start these quests because for the longest time, I was. Accepting the quest requires you to just talk to her to complete, and accepting Rurujo's tavern will have you speaking to three customers just sitting outside the tavern. Doing this will reward you with 120 CP, 10 milk, and 10 pork. The final quest that needs to be completed is Standard Cooking. That requires you to make 10 white sauce and 10 red sauce. Once you complete it, Turn it in for 300 CP and 5 special Arahaza meals. Now that you have the 3 quests completed, now you can start your weekly cooking quests. These quests range from Professional 1 to Master 5. These can be now navigated from your recurring tab in your quests and scrolling down to the Professional Cooking Weekly Cooking Quests. Hopefully all these quests can help you level up cooking, gain more CP, and earn you silver along the way. If I forgot anything or you still need help, be sure to let me know down in the comment section below. With all that cooking out of the way, be sure to give this guy a like if you enjoyed it, and I shall see you guys in another Black Desert Online Guide. Am I right? Everyone's like, no. No, you're, you're really not right. <laughs> just made my quote of the day. Oh man, yo, I'm wondering who's gonna fucking clip that shit. If not, I will clip.